Robert Wilson Show. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Oh, good morning. Um, I wonder if you have a copy of uh, 30 Days in the Samarkand Desert with a Spoon by A.E.J. Elliott. No, we haven't got it. Uh, maybe I can order it for uh, you. No, 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 no. A bit of a rush, actually. Oh, oh. Yes. Um, how about 101 Ways to Start a Monsoon by an Indian gentleman whose name eludes me for the moment? I never heard of that. Uh, no, not to worry, not to worry. Worth a try. Uh, can you help me with David Copperfield? Oh, yes, uh, Dickens. Uh, no. Sir, I beg your uh, pardon. No, Edmund Wells. Sir, I think you'll find that Charles Dickens... Uh, no, Charles Dickens wrote David Copperfield with two Ps. This is David Copperfield with one P by Edmund Wells. Uh, perhaps I should have mentioned that. Oh, yeah, well, well we don't have that. Honey, you've got a lot of books here. Yeah, we've got a lot of books here. Books all over, stacks and stacks of books. But we do not have David Copperfield with one P. It's a pity because it's more thorough than the Dickies. More thorough. More thorough than the Dickies. I wonder if it's worth having a look through your. No, sir, sir, sir. Please, please. Uh, sir, I'm sure that all of our David Copperfields have two P's. Uh, yes, probably. But uh, the original edition by Edmund Wells also had two P's. It was after that that they ran into the copyright difficulties. <laughs> uh, how about uh, Great Expectations? Yes, we, we got that. Uh, that's G-R-A-T-E, Expectations, also by Edmund Wells. G-R-A-T-E, Expectations? We don't have that. In fact, sir, uh, we, we don't have anything by Edmund Wells. He's not too popular. Uh, not Nicholas Nickleby, that's K-N-I-C-K-E-R-L-E-S-S. -S. No, 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 we don't have that either. Uh, how about Christmas Carol with a Q? We do not have Nicholas, and we do not have Christmas Cow with a Q, and I wish we did not have you. I'm sorry to bother you. Okay, not at all. Oh, ah, while I'm here, uh, do you have a copy of Ranaby Budge? Sir, as I said, we have no Edmund Wells. Oh, no, not Edmund Wells. Charles Dickens. Charles Dickens? Oh, do you mean, uh, Barnaby Rudge? Uh, no, Ranaby Budge by Charles Dickens with two Ks, the well-known Dutch author. <laughs> No, we don't have it. We haven't got Ronna B. Budge by Charles Dickens with two Ks, the well-known Dutch author. <laughs> Sir, perhaps I could save you a little time, perhaps, by adding that we also do not have Conner B. Fudge by Dolls Chicken or Stick Rick Stapers by Marl's Pickens with four M's and a silent Q. <laughs> Sir, we do not have it. I'd like to suggest that you try one of the large bookstores Downtown. I tell you, they all sent me to you. <laughs> I, I wonder if you've got a copy of The Amazing Adventures of Captain Gladys Stoat Pamphlet and her intrepid spaniel Stig among the giant pygmies of Corsica, <laughs> volume two. Sir, we do not have. Funny, you've got a it, lot of books. That's right, we got a lot of books yes, here. haven't you? Yes. Look, sir, I don't have all day to stand yes, here. I wonder if you've got you. a copy of. Uh... We don't have it. Yes. Guy came in a little bit more the last copy. But, but, but we're close. But, I thought I saw it over there. What? Where? Over there. What? Olsen Standard Book of British Birds. Olsen Standard Book of British Birds? Yes. Come on over here. Olsen. <laughs> Is that O-L-S-E-N Olsen? B I R D S birds. <laughs> we got it. I have it right here, sir. There it is. Uh, the expurgated version, of course. <laughs> sir, I don't think I quite understood you. The expurgated version. The expurgated version of Olson's Standard Book of British Birds? Yes, sir. The one without the gannet. <laughs> one without the gannet? Yes. He went to one without the gannet. Without the gannet. <laughs> Desire to have a gannet. Sir, they've all got the gannet. Well, I don't like them. The gannet is a standard British bird, and it's in all the books. I don't like them. They've got long, nasty beaks and little beady eyes. Ah, ah. And a gannet to any price. Look, man, nobody's going to make a special edition of British birds and leaving out the gannet for the gannet haters. I'm sorry, but I do want it without the gannet. Okay. If you want it without the gannet, that's what you have. You don't want no gannet, right? That's definite. And don't tell me you want the gannet if you... Okay, and you shall, okay, get it, get it. Okay, no, get it. Okay, there you go. 
I'm not too keen on Robins. <laughs> you don't like Robins. I don't like Robins. You don't want Gannets or Robins. Not Robins again. You do not desire Robins. You shall not have a Robin. There, go two pages of a Robin. They don't like ostriches. They don't like no ostriches. No ostriches. You don't like them. I take out the ostriches. I take out ducks. I take out chickens. Oh, no, I like ducks. I like ducks. I like ducks. Okay, there you go. Okay. There you go. I can't buy that. It's torn. Look at it. Look. I wonder if you've got a copy of uh, Tom Swift Combs His Hair. Or well, have you got a copy of The Bobsy Twins Get a Double Hernia? <laughs> well, I know. Have you got um, Ethel the Aardvark Goes Quantity Surveying? What is that? <laughs> Ethel the Aardvark Goes Quantity Surveying. Ethel the Aardvark. Let me take a look. Ethel the Aardvark Goes Quantity Surveying. There it is. That'll be three seventy-five. Well, um, uh, I, I don't have enough money with me. Then I'll take a deposit. Uh, I don't have any money with me. I'll take a check. I haven't got a checkbook. <laughs> it's all right. I got a plate. I don't have a bank account. <laughs> this is ridiculous. You know that? This is ridiculous. I've never done anything to anybody in my life. I'm standing here minding my own business. And all of a sudden, zap! You drop in on me. <laughs> this is right. Look, tell you what I do. You stand right. Don't touch the book, okay? Do not touch the book. Keep your hands off the book. You stand right there. I tell you what I'm going to do. Now, I got some money here. I'm going to buy the book for you. It'll be my gift to you. Book, okay? Three seventy-five. One, two, three, four dollars for the book. Now here's a couple hundred dollars for you to get out of town. <laughs> Okay. Now wait. It's wait. been a pleasure. No, wait, 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 wait. What is it now? I can't read. <laughs> <laughs> you can't read. Come on over here, man. <laughs> can't read. <laughs> Through the yard farm. I'm not comfortable. And <laughs> through the yard walk was trotting down the lane. Trotty, trotty, trot. <laughs> yes, trotty, trotty, trot. One lovely summer day, when she saw a quantity surveyor riding on his horse. Clippity, clippity, clop. <laughs> yes, clippity, clippity, clop. Trotty, trotty, trot. Clippity, clop, de clop. <laughs> <laughs>